sir. Here I go. Konnichiwa, salut, and hello in any other languages. Tip Top Gamer is back with another awesome episode of Pokemon Shield for the Nintendo Switch. I almost said Paper Mario Origami King. If you guys were last time, you'll know that we crossed Route 6 and came to Stoan side and battled Hop, our rival who is still concerned um, with, well, the words that, like, thinking about... The, Thinking that he is weak and weighing Leon down. Now in this awesome episode, we are going to fight the gym. But first I want to go up this way really quick. I just want to check to see if I have to go up this way before I go to the gym. Alright. Maybe I gotta go inside and then I get where I have to go next. Oh, or I have to fight the gym now. Hi there. Thanks for rolling by the, to have a chat with your mate, the ball guy. That bag on your back is looking pretty heavy. Speaking of heavy, let me give you this very special Pokeball. Is that the guy's head or is it... Just the hat. The Pokeball. Yup. Anyway, I obtained the Heavy Ball. Heavy Ball, it's rock and roll at catching heavy Pokemon. Pretty straightforward, alright? If you're a big fan, if you're a fan of big heavy Pokemon, then this is the Pokeball for you. Pokeballs are just full of surprises, don't you think? Yeah, I do think. Anyway, let's go. Eep, a gym challenger. Are you here to challenge the gym? I sure am. Okay, in that case, please change into your uniform. Yes, the changing room is uh, right over there. And don't forget, it has the number of subscribers I had around um the time that I got that I got this uniform. I have subscriber I have twelve subscribers at that point. But now I have twenty four subscribers, which is awesome guys. Thanks so much. Anyway, number twelve, do your best. Alright, we're heading into the ghost type gym challenge. Allow me to explain the gym mission in uh, for Stone Side's gym. To complete the mission, you'll need to ride in one of these cups and make your way to the goal. One of these cups. Oh, while trying to avoid obstacles. Let me tell you a bit more about how to operate this fun attraction. Rotate the control stick to the right. And the cup will spin to the right, to the right. Rotate it to the left to make the cup spin left. If you hit a wall, rotate the stick as quickly as you can to get yourself out of that sticky situation. Now have a good time watching the world spin as you try to reach the goal. Then on you go. 
Well, then I'll use spin and good luck. And Pokemon Sword, this would be a, um, this would be, um, a fighting type gym, right? There are a few differences to Pokemon Shield and Pokemon Sword. For example, the gyms. But anyway, spin the teacups too much and gym trainers go flying. Gym trainer Clee. Fly. Pumpkaboo. That's why I brought in my secret weapon. Bunsen! I pay back! Shadow Sneak, uh oh. That's okay. Still alive. Bullet see, huh? I'm okay. Not too bad. Perfect. And it goes down. Alright. Phantom. I'm gonna switch into Zebra. Let's go Night Slash. Sweet. Alright. And now another pump to boo. Let's finish it off with a nightshade or slash. Alright. Ooh, scary. Ah! No, it's not. Actually, no, it's not. Actually, it's the least scariest thing I've ever seen. Perfect. That went actually really well. Just like that, it's down. Right? Zebra is level 32. I lost. My consciousness has been sent flying. Another teacup. Oh, come on. I made it. Boom. Can I slip faster? Nope, I have to fight. Back and forth, back and forth, you're spinning. Back and forth, back and forth, me too. Lena. 
Oh, that's right. I forgot Coach Blood had a Galarian form in this game. I was like, why are they sending out a water type in a, in a ghost type gym? And then I'm like, oh, right. In this game, Corsula has like a a ghost type Galarian form. sharply rose. Nice. Alright, um, lift. Haha, <laughs> feel the wrath of my tongue. Doesn't even phase me. I'm gonna show you the inside of my tongue one last time. Well, not the inside of my tongue, that's actually kind of gross. Um, I'm gonna show you my tongue one last time. I'm sure you guys don't want to see the inside of someone else's tongue. But I did tip Junior back to the team too. Losing m made me remember, the gym leader wears a mask. <laughs> We're all wearing masks right now. Am I right or am I right? I think you guys know the answer to that. the challenge? Can you understand what ghost type Pokemon are weak to? I don't think so. I think I do. Alright, let's go. Going back against Roy right here. Let's go Nightshade. I knew that was gonna happen, but I didn't care. I just wanted to see if I could do it. Alright. I wanted to tip Junior. Let's do it. Haven't seen him in a while. Have we? Now that is a good hit. Okay. Perfect. Hypnosis. I have all attack moves. But the question is, what do I want to get? What do I want to get rid of? Let's get rid of what happens to him. All right, let's do it. We got hypnosis. Cutie's level five. Now a drift limb is coming out.
Good try putting him to sleep. Worked. Perfect. So now I have time to heal. Yes, it's still asleep, so I have time to, I have time to attack. Shadow Ball, let's go. Boom! That was a nice, solid hit. And he's still asleep, that's perfect. Okay, with this, I should manage to finish. Yes! Alright. If you understand type matchups, it's only natural that it'll be easier to win. I got some more money. Really? Cutie's evolving? That's awesome! Nice, now I have an Inteleon. That is awesome. Sniper shot. I um What is that looking like? Power of 80 and this is 60. Let's get rid of a water pulse for a sniper shot. That is cool. Alright, so we get the we get a gym battle and we get an Intellion in this in this episode. Goal! Gym mission cleared. Now it's time we fight the gym the gym leader. Here I go. Alright, so here we go against Alistair. Going with the Iron Mask as her first choice. I'm going with my cutie. Give sniper shot a try. Yeah! I just sniped you! You guys see that? That was awesome. Alright. Now Rook is level 33. Mimic is coming out. Um Let's leave let's leave um to the end. Here's Mimic Q. Just snipe him again. All right, I was like, "Oh, that is so bad," and I'm like, "Oh, it's just this guy's, this guy's busted." I'm fine. Go for another sniper shot.
Oh, right, I can't guard. And this thing is down! And now I know what's coming out next. Oh. Alright, so it's Corsula's evolved form. Cursula. If I know it's coming up after this. I like Sniper Shot. Hex. Oh, wow. Just lost my Inteleon. Okay. Alright. Alright, Kershula. Bring it. Bring it on good. I'm gonna Shadow Ball. Tip, you can survive. Oh. Wow, that went bad. Um. I'm actually gonna go into Pillow Swine so I can heal up, um, Zebra really quick. Alright. And let's go Potion. Super Potion on Zebra. Nice. Hex. So that should be good, and then... Let's go to Ice Shark. Alright. Nice! Alright, a level 37 and a level 33. Amnesia. Um... The user temporarily empties its mind to forget its concerns. This sharply erases the, the user's special defense. Huh. You know what, I'm gonna get rid of Flail. I got Amnesia. Scary face. Um, this one lowers the speed. That one lowers the special attack. Um. Yeah. I don't really want to warn it. So Gengar's coming out. And I'm gonna go into Zebra. Cause this get cause this thing can go crazy. Well, not go crazy, but it is crazy, so you guys will see in just a minute. My very last Pokemon, how lonely, how frightening. Max Phantasm. So we're going up against a Gigantamax Gengar right here. There he is. And he is massive. But I'm going Dynamax. You're gonna be okay, Zebra! Am I faster? Nope. 
Alright, but it didn't do too bad. I'll be okay. This defense spell. Perfect. Let's go! It's attack rises, but it's defense falls. It's almost gone. I gotta heal. Um. Nice. But that barely did anything. Lost my guy, Zebra, right there. But it's okay. I still got Final Swine and Rook. I'm going with my man Rook. Yes! And it's back to a normal size Gengar. Let's go drill pack and finish it off. Oh, okay. Um, wow. Uh. Uh, that is not good. Come on, I'm so close. I'm so close. Come on. Yes! Hello, Swan. You did it, buddy. You won us the gym challenge. And now you're the only one that gets experience points. I did it. I nearly lost my max... My max... Mask from the shock. That was... Wow. I didn't see your skill for what it is. I got lots of money, and I'm going to get a ghost badge. Crumbs. That was ace. Here, a ghost badge. Nice! I can now catch up on Pokemon of up to level 50. I'm um, 40. Sorry. Um... Good luck with, um, everything. Challenger June, you defeated our gym leader, Alistair. Take this TM as a reward for your victory. I got X? Nice. And a complimentary ghost type uniform. A ghost uniform. The ghost badge suits you. You're, you're right on track, June. Alright. And by the way, guys, I'm still wonder trading here, so... If you guys want to get a cool Pokemon from Tip Top Gamer, then now's your time. But it's only going to be level 12, I'm sorry. Um, Bow Wark! Well, if it isn't Sonya, looks like my Yamper really likes you, huh? Anyway, we've run into each other at a good time. You know the mural here in Stoneside? It's said to tell the story of the hero of Galar as well. Though what's there today is actually a replica of the ancient arts that used to be here. You tend to see surprisingly sharp insights. So, I was wondering what you might think of think when you see the ruins. Boom! What in the world was that? Sounds like it came from the direction of the ruins, too. Let's have a look, Yamper. 
Let's have a look. Come on, Yamper. I shall follow you too. I would like to see what that big boom was. Oh, ow. <laughs> I just rammed into a railing. Wait, I saw something. A max revive. And I know what it is. Ah, oh, what are you doing? Destroy it. Destroy it all! We're going to find those squishing stars. We've got to bring the chairman more wishing stars if we want to please him. Cobra G Jai. If you're truly the chairman's Pokemon, then you should feel grateful for this chance to help him find wishing stars. Oh my, oh my, you again? So you think that you can start collecting wishing stars now and get the in the chairman's favor? That's the way of things, it, it is. Is it? I see. So you do have some cunning in you. But I won't have it. I won't allow anyone to stand in my way. Alright, so I probably should have killed before this. Um. Trainer Beads coming up here. Oh, my Pokemon are all healed? Oh, that's actually really good. Side shot. Wow! Whoa, that could have gone better. Alright. So. I dropped my controller. Um, I'm sitting in um, my guy Cutie. Get ready for a snipe. Snipe, snipe! Shot! Huh. I've already seen more than enough in, in Judge you. <laughs> I'm so sorry, guys. Um, sniper, go. One more time. That's awesome. Alright, Hatsum. Hatrima. Hatrim. Um, let's keep Cutie out. Alright. Look how cute it is. Alright, I don't know how what's gonna work on it. I'm just gonna sniper shot. I love this sniper shot move. But I got it. My partner's move is simply splendid, wouldn't you say? Seriously, that's all you got? Fine. I'm gonna go first sucker punch. Boom! Nice. Here I go! Second punch! Boom. Alright. We're actually doing pretty good here. I only lost Bunsen. Which I'm sorry about, by the way. Authorica. Um, keep it out. All right. Huh? 
จอยเฮียครับพี่กัดไซบินเชลโอเคไม่ต้องห่วงน่าจะได้เธอทำไม่ฟิสต์ผมจะโอเคสักครู่นะโอเคสกิลส์ของเออมาร์สเตอร์สปอนส์ตอนนี้จ้าผมจะคิดไว้ที่ผมจะเล่นนี้ให้เป็นผู้ชนะคุณคิดว่าผมจะให้เขาเล่นโอ้คุณทำให้เขาเป็นแบบนี้โอเคดีไม่ได้ก็จะเริ่มต้นจากการไล่ชาร์ดเอฟเอฟเอฟฟินิชเชอร์ยัสฉันทำเสร็จแล้วจะต้องมีการผิดพลาดหรือการแพ้ไม่ต้องการการแพ้เลยโทษไม่ต้องการการแพ้ Especially because your Pokemon fainted. But why? How could this be? How could someone like you get in my way? I was the one chosen by the chairman. I was the one who was to defeat the champion. I'm one of the elite. Someone who can shutter the future of the Galar region. Challenger B. I wonder what you were up to when you asked to borrow the chairman's chopper jaw. I can't believe you tried to use the chairman's Pokemon to destroy a historical site. Who cares of some ancient ruins when the next thousand years are at stake? Do you stand in the path of a Pokemon's simple beam or something? How do you expect to support the chairman with that sort? Of thinking, young bead. It pains me to have to say this, but I am truly disappointed. It's true that I am the one who found you back when you were all alone. I saw talent in you. You reminded me a little bit of myself back when I was young. That's why I sent you to, to a trainer's school to get to give you a chance to, at success. But trying to destroy the mural, part of Galar's history, you show no love towards Galar. You are clearly not a worthy challenger for the gym challenge. We will decide what to do with you later. For now, you will return to Hammerlock. You must be joking, right? You're disqualifying me from the gym challenge, but you're the one who endorsed me. There are a hundred different ways we could sort this out. Why are you choosing the worst possible option? Option, challenger B. I will be taking those wishing stars that you have gathered. Wait a minute! Ha ha! Take that, B. Ah, uh, Sonia and June too. Terrible shame is all this. An absolute disaster. I never wish to see us lost, lose challengers for this sort of reason. Yet we do what we must do to keep the 
Let me start over. Yet we do what we must do to keep things fair and sportsmanlike. You know, during one of B's matches, I heard the announcer say that Bede has no family. Apparently, it was Rose who took Bede under his wing, and so Bede was battling for the chairman's sake. What an awful turn of events. I hope the mural survived all that. Uh oh, something's about to happen. Oh no, it didn't survive! It didn't survive? Oh, wait. Those two, there are two doggy statues behind it. Two statues of two people. There's the sword and the shield. Light bulb. Something sparked. Something definitely sparked. Not a brilliant turn of events. But the ruins were brought into the light for us to see. What does this tell us about Galar's legends? Pokemon, a sword and a shield. Right, more than any hero, these th there's those things that appear to be Pokemon that stand out. Not just that. But those Pokemon appear to be holding a sword and a shield as if they were using them. Anything else look interesting to you? The hero was actually two people, the same as the tapestries. Maybe that? Oh, good observation. There really were two heroes. But if that's the case, then why only the one statue at the Bidu drop in? More than any statue of a hero or old tapestry, these ruins made it truly ancient in truly ancient times must show us the real truth. Which means... Well, it says Pokemon Shield, and um, it's not a Pokemon Sword, so the Shield is a Pokemon! Yup, I was thinking the same thing. Seems like as at some point in history, the Sword and Shield were combined with two actual Pokemon and treated it as the same thing. And then what? They just fade from history. Two young heroes, the Sword and Shield were actually Pokemon, but why would the truth of these ruins be hidden with those stories were their stories depicted in art? With your help, I really feel like we made a, a big discovery here. Thanks. I'll give you a couple of these, so you keep giving it your best in the gym challenge, too, okay? Guess you'll be holding, heading to Ballonly next, right? I got two revives. Alright, so that was a great episode. Guys, thanks so much for tuning in to this awesome episode of Pokemon Shield for the Nintendo Switch. Please tune in next time. We'll start heading to the next city and the next gym. So long, everybody, and thanks for watching.